Hi, welcome to this video called Mexican Democracy Timeline. In this video, we are going to check how democracy has become better in our country. Let's check it out. Let's start in the year 1946. In that year, the federal electoral law registered three political parties for the first time. They were PAN, PRI, and the extinct PDM. In the year 1955, Mexican women got the right to vote as a promise of President Adolfo Ruiz Cortines. In the year 1976, can you believe that José López Bortillo became the president after being the unique candidate? That provoked that in the year 1977, Jesús Reyes Heroles led the first electoral reform to make the system more plural and transparent. In the year 1989, Ernesto Rufo Appel, who was a member of PAN, became the first governor of a different political party in winning the governor elections. That was the first time that PRI lost an election. In the year 1990, IFE was founded and was created to promote the citizen participation and organize elections. In the year 1991, the first IDs with photo were created to identify the citizen's face, because before these IDs didn't have any photo. In the year 2000, Vicente Fox from PAN won the presidential elections in Mexico and for the first time another political party governed after 71 years of pre-regime. In the year 2005, Mexicans living abroad, in this case that means Mexicans living in other countries, got the chance to vote in the year 2014, INE was founded and substituted IFE as a new institution in charge of regulating elections. In the year 2018, they were the elections with the highest participation ever, with 60% of voters going to vote for president, senators, deputies, governors and some municipal majors and well that was everything about this timeline if you like this video why don't you give it a like and subscribe to my channel if you are not subscribed yet goodbye